As our technology continues to grow, humanity has always begun to peer ever closer at the numerous impossible to understand astronomical wonders of the universe that surrounds us. Though some of these wonders may prove to be nothing more than recurring features of our intriguing galaxy, there appears to be a number of anomalies close to our area of space and time that seems to be impossible to understand, and prove to be rare formations most likely never seen anywhere else. So today we'll be taking a look at these incredible discoveries and attempting to find the most mysterious places in the universe. The Hand of God Referred to by astronomers and astrophysicists as PSR B150958, this celestial anomaly is believed to be a roughly 1,700-year-old pulsar, and it was first discovered back in 1982 by the Einstein X-ray Observatory. They used then state-of-the-art X-ray technology to locate the pulsar, and take strange images of the entity that is noted as being more than 17,000 light-years away. At the time, pulsars were relatively unknown objects that were small rotating dense masses that would emit radio waves in pulsating bursts that were otherwise impossible to explain. It took researchers years before they realised that such objects were formed as the consequences of a star imploding on itself, forcing its electrons and protons to form neutrons that would increase its mass density so large that a single sugar cube size of mass would weigh over 100 million tonnes. As the star implodes, its rational speed increases, causing the formation of a massive amount of radio waves as its rational period emits pulses of such radio waves out into space. It was due to these discoveries that the Einstein Observatory had originally believed that gathering the visual data of the pulsar would prove to be more than enough information to help astronomers better understand the complex movements of pulsars, and what can be expected from them in the near future including the rates in which they emit radio waves and how they were formed. Oddly enough, it appeared the information gathered by the observatory only helped to make the pulsar far more mysterious than ever believed possible. Shortly after data was gathered surrounding the PSR, the object ended up being renamed to the Hand of God, as X-ray images showed what appeared to be a massive hand stretching out from the pulsar and forming a cluster of radio waves. The hand-like structure was so mysterious that NASA experts had a hard time piecing together the projected math that would have caused such a formation to have occurred naturally. Additionally, it appeared the pulsar was still relatively young, only 1,700 years old and resting roughly 17,000 light-years away. No new information surrounding the strange pulsar can be gathered, and it appears that not much more can be understood until further data can be achieved with emerging technologies. How the Hand of God formed remains a mystery to this day. Gliese 581c Hostile Planet Discovered back on the 27th of April in 2007, the Gliese 581c exoplanet took the world by storm, as it proved to be the first discovered exoplanet with a believed to be habitable atmosphere and liquid water on its surface. It was the first ever deemed Earth-like planet to have been discovered and so came with a massive amount of optimism from scientists that believed the planet to be a potentially habitable planet, and could be included in future colonisation missions. This thought seemed to become a reality when evidence of it being less than 21 light years away from Earth made it a prime planet for habitable colonisation. Unfortunately, as new data from the exoplanet began to pour in, it quickly led to new revelations that deemed the planet far too hostile for humans to ever adapt to. Evidence came forward the entire exoplanet was tidally locked in orbit around its sun. Tidally locked refers to a lack of day and night rotation that leaves one face of the planet always facing the sun, and the other side always facing the cold vacuum of space. Although this could create beautiful locations of a never-ending sunset for colonisation efforts, it does prove to make the majority of the planet's surface far too hostile than expected. This tidal lock is not the end of its hostility. As new evidence surfaced shortly after the discovery of its tidal lock, that determined the collected mass of the planet to be more than five times larger than that of our planet. This would mean that if a human were to step foot on the planet, 
they would have to overcome the five times more gravity as compared to Earth. This would put a man at 200 pounds well over 1,000 pounds, a weight that would completely pulverize joints and skeletal structures over the course of several hours. Although this new information makes the planet a bad candidate for colonization efforts, it does not mean that life could not have naturally evolved on the planet. This appeared to be the sentiment of the research back in 2008, as on the 9th of October during that year research scientists sent a message to Gliese 581C, and they did this using a high-powered digital radio signal that contained a digital time capsule that held more than 401 messages. These are thought to reach the planet by early 2029. Five Five Cancri E Diamond Planet Resting a short 40 light years away from our planet appears to be the largest mass of diamonds ever to exist within our solar neighbours. Known as Five Five Cancri E, there rests a planet made almost entirely out of diamonds that is expected to be roughly eight times the collective mass of our planet Earth. Unfortunately, if you planned on mining the planet to father its precious gems, you would find the entire planet to be so hostile that it's most likely almost entirely covered in lava. This planet is also thought to be tidally locked. This leaves the day side of the planet to be more than 1,700 degrees, a temperature more than hot enough to turn iron into liquid. Its gravity works out to be more than eight times that of Earth's gravity, and a large amount of data concerning its surface temperature variations have been connected to a large amount of possible volcanic activity that's said to release large clouds of dust that can cover whole areas of the planet into an impenetrable darkness. If that does not make mining operations seem near impossible, the orbit of the planet around its sun takes less than 18 hours to complete. That means that an entire year on 55 Cancri E is less than a single day on Earth, making landing and launching to and from the planet nearly impossible to maintain. The Himiko Cloud Making up some of the largest known celestial objects in the universe are massive gas clusters known as Lyman Alpha Blob. It's completely understandable for their massive size as scientists since 2000 have documented Lyman Alpha Blobs. They're known as being the initial starting point of a galaxy, with the gases of the large blobs soon to collapse in on themselves, forming hundreds of billions of stars and subsequently an entire galaxy. For many astronomers, their size was the only interesting aspect of the Lyman Alpha Blobs, before an impossible to explain discovery was made back in May of 2009. When researchers were looking to the past, measuring out the universe moments after the Big Bang by looking as far out as they can, they spotted a blob known as the Himiko Cloud. The odd thing about this blob is that it appeared to have been more than 12.9 billion light years away from Earth, making the image of the Himiko Cloud an incredibly young sighting from just slightly after the creation of the universe. Normally this would not be so alarming as many celestial bodies are seen during this point in time. However, the Himiko Cloud was more than 55 light years across and held 10 times more mass than the largest celestial object found in the early universe. This meant for reasons not entirely understood. The Himiko Cloud was far larger, far younger and far more developed than any other place in the universe, creating an impossible to understand mystery that begs a far deeper question on the nature of the true age of the universe. FRB 121102 Something somewhere out in the vastness of space is some strange anomalous mystery object that continues to throw extremely large bursts of radio waves out from around it. It does this in all directions traveling at the speed of light. Fast radio bursts referred to as FRBs have always been a mystery for astronomers and scientists in the field trying to understand the strange nature of the cosmos, and appear to be caused by super dense pulsars that litter the galaxy and are the result of a collapse and dying star. But oddly enough, there appeared to be a fast radio burst that did not seem to match the FRBs of previous pulsar data collection, leading many to believe the strange anomaly was actually that of an extraterrestrial civilization. This FRB is known as FRB 121102, 
and despite being more than 3 billion light years away, has consistently sent more than 15 steady FRBs towards our planet. Currently, the SETI project is working to detect the next radio burst to try and decipher it if it has an alien meaning, as previous data shows that it's far too consistent and repetitive to be a standard pulsar. So what do you think of these five different mysterious places in the universe? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.